The model on the theme of women empowerment and heritage craft village Raghurajpur was highly appreciated by the selection committee. The Ministry of Defence has written to the Odisha Chief Secretary appraising the decision. As per the direction of Chief Minister Naveen Patnayak, Chairman Panch D and Naveen Odisha, VK Pandian is on a two-day visit to Sundargarh district to review the progress of various developmental works in the district and interact with the general public. A total of 441 junior engineers, civil, today joined the state government in the Water Resources Department. An induction program was organized for the new recruits at the Convention Center in Lok Seva Bhavan in presence of Chief Minister Naveen Patnayak. Vigilance sleuths today caught a forest guard in Nabaranpur district for possession of ill-gotten cash of 1 rupee and 53 paisa. Koksara police have arrested two youths, Jitendra Sabar, 23, and Sankar Rao, 23, of Dhansara village for allegedly attempting to rape a young woman. Padmushri Kamala Pujari of Jaipore was admitted to the district headquarters hospital after she fell ill. A team of doctors is treating her in a special cabin at the hospital. Khordha police have cracked the mystery behind Tuesday's brutal murder of an artist Rashmi Ranjan Baliar Singh in Sagdabhanga village under Jankia police limits with the arrest of accused Somanathla. When it comes to Kho Kho Gujarat giants Young V, Subramani has to thank his elder brother Sarvanan for felicitating his entry into the sport. Now representing the Adani Sports line owned Gujarat Giants in the second season of the Ultimate Kho Kho League, the beast year old Subramani has come a long way because of the support from his family. The Bhitarknika National Park in Kendrapara district will remain closed to visitors from January 5 to 13, 2024 in view of the annual census of the saltwater crocodiles and birds. Mizoram Chief Minister Lal Duhoma on Thursday met Prime Minister Narendra Modi in New Delhi and discussed several issues including the Myanmar refugee issue. India on Thursday announced a rupees, Nepalese rupee, 1000 crore grant for Nepal's reconstruction bid during the 7th meeting of Nepal-India Joint Commission at the Foreign Ministerial level, an official said. The Ambassador of Israel to the United Nations, Gilad Erdan said that the Islamic Republic of Iran led by the Ayatollah was the one that ties together all the elements of destruction in the Middle East. With the pitch for the second test between South Africa and India offering exaggerated variable bounce and seam movement, a retiring Dean Elgar said the 22 yards for the match played completely different to what everyone had expected. Bollywood actress Janhavi Kapoor who recently appeared on the streaming chat show Coffee with Karan along with her sister Khushi Kapoor, shared the heartbreaking moment when she came to know that her mother, the legendary actress Shridevi suddenly died. Bollywood superstar Amir Khan's daughter Ira Khan and Nupur Shikhre are now officially husband and wife. The two signed the marriage registration document in the presence of friends and family at the Taj Lands End in the Bandra area of Mumbai. Taking a stern view of the recent drone attacks on two ships in the high seas, Defence Minister Rajanath Singh on Tuesday warned that they will not be spared and shall be given stringent punishment, as India is playing the role of a net security provider for the entire Indian Ocean region. The BJP on Tuesday constituted a Pandra member election management committee for West Bengal ahead of the Lok Sabha elections scheduled next year. Bollywood actor Raza Murad gave away the Delhi Star Awards from the Rights Platform, an organization that for 23 years has been honoring public figures who have excelled in their respective fields. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Tuesday said that Sikh gurus have taught Indians to live for the glory of their land and served as an inspiration to make the country better and develop. A Russian Navy ship was damaged in a Ukrainian missile attack on the port town of Fyodosia in Crimea on Tuesday, the Kremlin said in a statement. South Korea is in talks with Poland to ensure the multiple arms contracts signed between Korean companies and the Polish government will be carried out as agreed despite the change of the leadership in Warsaw, a Seoul official said on Tuesday. Virat Kohli and Shreyas Iyer came together to rescue India after an early tumble, adding 67 runs for the unfinished fourth wicket partnership as the visitors reached 91 thirds in 26 overs at lunch on the first day of the Boxing Day test against South Africa at the Super Sport Park here on Tuesday. Indian cricketer Smriti Mandhana has opened up on her cricket journey and the challenges she faced in becoming a cricketer.
पीपल यूज टू टॉन्ट माई पेरेंट्स सेइंग दैट नो वन विल मैरी हर स्मृति से इन अक्वेस्ट फॉर अ न्यू टाइटल स्पॉन्सर फॉर द इंडियन प्रीमियर लीग आई पी एल द बोर्ड ऑफ कंट्रोल फॉर क्रिकेट इन इंडिया बी सी सी आई हैज लेड डाउन स्ट्रिंजेंट कंडीशन फॉर पोटेंशियल बिडर्स सेड अ रिपोर्ट हैविंग क्वालिफाइड फॉर नेक्स्ट ईयर्स टी ट्वेंटी वर्ल्ड कप द नेदरलैंड्स मेन्स क्रिकेट टीम विल प्रिपेयर फॉर द मेगा इवेंट्स बाय प्लेइंग सेवन मैचेज अगेंस्ट लोकल टीम्स इन साउथ अफ्रीका इन द न्यू ईयर एक्ट्रेस अकंशा रंजन कपूर हु इज नोन फॉर गिल्टी रे एंड मोनिका ओ माई डार्लिंग हैज स्टार्टेड शूटिंग फॉर हर तेलुगु फिल्म मायावन इन हैदराबाद अमिताभ बच्चन हु हैज बीन मैरीड टू एक्ट्रेस जया बच्चन फॉर फिफ्टी ईयर्स गेव अ मैरिज एडवाइस टू इंडियन क्रिकेटर ईशान किशन सेइंग दैट द वाइफ इज द सरकार ऑफ द फैमिली एक्ट्रेस अंकिता लोखंडे इन द लेटेस्ट एपिसोड ऑफ बिग बॉस सेवेंटीन वॉज सीन टॉकिंग अबाउट हाउ शी कुड नॉट हैंडल हर फॉर्मर बॉयफ्रेंड एंड लेट स्टार सुशांत सिंह राजपूत इंटीमेट सीन्स इन फिल्म सच एज शुद्ध देसी रोमांस एंड पी के द ग्लोबल रैली इन दिसंबर लेड बाई द यूएस मार्केट हैज लिफ्टेड मोस्ट मार्केट सिग्निफिकेंटली एंड इंडिया वॉज फॉर्चुनेट टू हैव द लिफ्ट फ्रॉम द स्टेट इलेक्शन रिजल्ट टू सेज वी के विजय कुमार चीफ इन्वेस्टमेंट स्ट्रैटेजिस्ट एट जियोजिट फाइनेंशियल सर्विसेज Some of the most active ransomware groups are deliberately switching on remote encryption for their cyber attacks, infiltrating deeper into companies and crippling their operations, a report showed on Tuesday.